Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to do an LCD replacement in a Dell Inspiron N4010. First, I'll show you that the LCD is in fact broken and that we do need to fix it. As you can tell, there's a spider web in the screen, as some people like to call it. Alright, first thing we'll do is we take the battery out of the laptop. Taking the battery out of any electronic is always a good thing to do. It helps from static discharge and frying anything in the actual computer itself. Alright, next, what we're going to do is we're going to go take this bezel out here and we're going to pry from the inside. Like so. And then we're just going to go all the way around the laptop. Slowly prying from the inside. You don't want to pry from the outside because that's how you can break the little plastic rivets on the inside. There we go. First step done. Next, there's four screws holding the LCD brackets in. We're going to take those out. Next, there's four screws on the side here, if you can see that, and one down here below. We're going to take those off. Also, just another tip, um, always use a magnetic screwdriver. It's Life is just a lot easier when you use one. Alright, so now we have the LCD out. We're going to take it out of the connector that's right here. And bam, it comes right out. Next, take the new LCD. Take it out of all the packaging and everything. And you're just going to basically follow the steps backwards. Just go ahead and plug the connector cable in. Here, first we'll, we'll test it just to make sure everything is kosher with it. Because not usually, but sometimes you just get an LCD that is broken from the manufacturer and you don't want to go ahead and put everything back together and then have the LCD not work. Alright, so now we're going to want to test the LCD out. So put the battery back in, go ahead and Plug the power up, and bam, it works. Looks great. Alright, just go ahead and turn that back off. 
And all we have to do is just go ahead and follow the steps backwards. Just so gonna put these four side screws in first. I like to do the top ones first, and that makes doing the bottom ones a lot easier. Four side screws are in. And just go back and put the four silver screws in. Go ahead and put your bezel back on. And that just snaps right back into place like so. It's done. There you go. If you have any questions, feel free to give us a call. Have a great day.